And can the season continues as um, the famous line in uh, the Gladiator, not yet. <laughs> and the Bruins are not yet going home. Mike Rowe, thanks to your effort, your leadership today as a senior, you and then Nicola uh, did a lot of damage out there with your shooting, you were on target, you were effective, accurate. And the spirit was very high today. Oh, definitely. You know, uh, just not ready to go home. I uh, just want to keep playing with this team as long as I can. Um, you know, it's awesome being out there on the court, so we're going to do everything that we can to win. Mike, we've been covering you since day one, it seems like um, a while back. Mm -hmm. uh, but now you're, as they say, heading home uh, for the stretch run here and uh, quite a, a distinguished career at UCLA. Just reflect back on the meaning of playing at UCLA and Division One level to our viewers, to the youngsters out there, because a chance to hear you speak about having lived that experience. Uh, you know, it's just a great tradition here. You know, being a part of the UCLA basketball team, it's like uh, the best fraternity in the world. Uh, you know, going to all these Final Fours that we have, mm -hmm. it's been amazing. You know, the Pac-10 championships and playing in the huge games, you know, it's, it's nothing like it, and uh, it's awesome. Coach's uh, strategy and the planning and preparation for this tournament, because this is the second season and not much time to prepare, but you knew the opponents going into it. But has there been anything different? Coach Holland in the press conference was talking about the press, I mean, excuse me, the zone and the man-to-man -man going in and out of that. Your thoughts on how that, that has helped the team? Uh, you know, we focused more on man-to-man uh, -man today. Mm -hmm. It's getting back to our roots, and, you know, we, we played it well. Uh, held them to 40% field goal percentage today. And, uh, you know, we threw the zone in there a couple times, you know, just to keep them off guard. And, you know, going in between the two, I think, helped. Very athletic team where Arizona was, uh, Nick Wise, they had a lot of weapons, Williams inside, so they were pretty well balanced against you, but you stood in there, you weathered their storms, and uh, free throws again at the end. Oh, yeah, you know, we shot that well. I think we shot above 75%. Mm -hmm. You know, that's uh, something that we've been talking about, and uh, we came through in the clutch today. Mike, let's ask one more question. Academically, you're going to be graduating, of course, or you have graduated. You've got your degree, and you're going to move on to other things. Uh, what's, what's ahead for Mike Roll in the near future? Uh, you know, I want to play professionally, uh, wh wherever it be. You know, after that, you know, something in the business world, maybe a consultant, something like that, a private equity firm, anything along those lines. Okay. All right. But the task at hand, and one more game, another game. Now I would say one more, another game. Odds are looking uh, pretty good for the Bruins. They're making a, a second run here, a deep run into the tournament. That's what we're hoping for. Thank you very much. Congratulations on a big win All right. over the Arizona Wildcats. We're here in the post and in the locker room, as you can tell here with UCLA Bruins, they're victorious today over the uh, Arizona Wildcats. A huge win, and we're going to go over the details with that just in a moment. We're talking to more of the players here in the Bruin locker room. We'll be right back.